The BrahMos is a medium-range ramjet supersonic cruise missile that can be launched from submarine, ships, aircraft, or land. It is the fastest supersonic cruise missile in the world. With the maximum speed is Mach 3 and the unit cost, 2.75 million US dollar and launch. Platform is ship, submarine, aircraft, and land-based mobile launchers. And it is used by Indian Army, Indian Navy, Indian Air Force. The manufacturer is BrahMos Aerospace Limited. And accuracy is 1 meter sept. There are many variants are ship launched, surface launched, submarine launched, air launched. It is a joint venture between the Russian Federations. NPO Missionistroyniya and India's Defense Research and Development Organization, DRDO, who together have formed BrahMos Aerospace. It is based on the Russian P-800 Onyx cruise. Missile and other similar sea-skimming Russian cruise missile technology. The name BrahMos is a portmanteau formed from the names of two rivers, the Brahmaputra of India and the Moskva of Russia. BrahMos is the world's fastest anti-ship cruise missile in operation. The land-launched and ship-launched versions are already in service. An air-launched variant of BrahMos appeared in 2012 and entered service in 2019. A hypersonic version of the missile, BrahMos-2 is also presently under development with a speed of Mach 782. Boost aerial fast strike capability. It was expected to be ready for testing by 2020. India wanted the BrahMos to be based on a mid-range cruise missile like the P-700 Granite. Its propulsion is based on the Russian missile, and missile guidance has been developed by BrahMos Aerospace. The missile is expected to reach a total order of US $13 billion. In 2016, as India became a member of the Missile Technology Control Regime, MTCR, India and Russia are now planning to jointly develop a new generation of BrahMos missiles with 800 kilometers plus range and an ability to hit protected targets with pinpoint accuracy. In 2019, India upgraded the missile with a new range of 650 kilometers with plans to eventually upgrade all missiles to a range of 1500 kilometers. BrahMos claims it has the capability of attacking surface targets by flying as low as 5 meters in altitude and the maximum altitude it can fly is 14,000 meters. It has a diameter of 70 centimeters and a wingspan of 1.7 meters. It can gain a speed of Mach 2.8 and has a maximum range of 450 kilometers. The ship-launched and land-based missiles can carry a 200 kilograms warhead, whereas the aircraft-launched variant, BrahMos A, can carry a 300 kilograms warhead. It has a two-stage propulsion system with a solid propellant rocket for initial acceleration and a liquid-fueled ramjet responsible for sustained supersonic cruise. Air-breathing ramjet. Propulsion is much more fuel-efficient than rocket propulsion, giving the BrahMos a longer range than a pure rocket-powered missile would achieve. The high speed of the BrahMos likely gives it better target penetration characteristics than lighter subsonic cruise missiles, such as Tomahawk. Being twice as heavy and almost four times as fast as Tomahawk, the BrahMos has more than 32 times the on-cruise kinetic energy of a Tomahawk missile, although it carries only three-fifths the payload and a fraction of the range, which suggests that the missile was designed with a different tactical role. Its 2.8 Mach speed means that it cannot be intercepted by some existing missile defense systems and its precision makes it lethal to water targets. It can be launched either in a vertical or inclined position and is capable of covering targets over a 360-degree horizon. The BrahMos missile has an identical configuration for land, sea, and sub-sea platforms. The air-launched version has a smaller booster and additional tail fins for added stability during launch. The BrahMos has currently been configured for aerial deployment with the Su-30 MKI as its carrier. On 5 September 2010 BrahMos created a record for the first supersonic steep dive export of BrahMos several countries, including Vietnam, South Africa, Egypt, Oman, Chile, and Brunei have expressed interest in the missile. In February 2010, a senior executive said that BrahMos was in negotiations with Chile, Brazil, South Africa and Indonesia. Regarding the purchase of the missile, Malaysia is also reported to be considering the purchase of the missile for use on its Keta-class warships and fighter jets. Informal negotiations are ongoing between India and Vietnam for the sale of BrahMos missiles. BrahMos Aerospace has said that several Southeast Asian and Latin American countries have 
expressed interest in the system, with particular interest in naval and coastal defense versions, and that a definite list of countries exists. Industry sources say that. Interested countries include Vietnam, Indonesia, and Venezuela. Hope you like our content. Please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel thanks you guys for watching our video have a good day.